Despite quarterly profits of more than $300 million, Cummins plans to lay off up to 1,500 employees by the end of the year, as WTIU's Alyssa Nunley reports. The effects of the pink slips will be felt by the community at large. When Cummins employees take lunch, they visit businesses in downtown Columbus. Papa's Grill and Deli general manager Dustin Craig says he relies on Cummins employees as a revenue stream. Uh, they bring people in from all over the world with their different headquarters across the world. And uh, it's just uh, a lot of our business is due to them coming here, especially in the downtown area. Mary Johnston's husband works at Cummins and says she feels differently about the engine manufacturer's effect on the community. It's terrible. I know that they're trying to do the right thing, that they're, you know, trying to be a profitable company. But it's, it's really hard for people to lose their jobs today. Johnston didn't say whether her husband will be among those laid off, but says she feels the roller coaster nature of the company's boom and bust employment picture offsets some of the good Cummins does for Columbus. For WTIU News, I'm Melissa Nutley.